Roku devices are one of the best ways to stream all of your favorite shows on your TV. While it's great at what it does, all of its secondary features, including screen mirroring, are a bit less refined. If you use an Android device and need to use your Roku to screen mirror, here's what you need to know. Before we begin, it's best to check your screen mirroring settings on your Roku device. From your home screen, scroll down and select Settings, followed by System. From here, select Screen Mirroring and check that Screen Mirroring mode is set to Prompt for more control over what can be mirrored on your Roku device. If you can't find the setting, you might be using an older Roku device. While most of the latest Roku devices support it, the Roku Express and Express Plus both introduced before 2017 lack this feature. Particularly, the 2019 Roku Express Plus only supports screen mirroring through HDMI output. Once that's done, unlock your Android device and swipe down twice to access your quick settings menu. Look for a tile labeled Smart View or Screencast. If you don't see a tile, you might have to add it. How exactly to do so depends on which version of Android you're using and which device in particular you own. Tapping on this tile will bring up a list of compatible devices you can mirror to. Select your Roku and a prompt will then appear on your TV, notifying you that your device would like to cast. Choose allow for one-time permission or always allow if you want to skip this step the next time you connect your device and you'll see your device mirrored on screen. If your Android device doesn't support screen mirroring through native smart view or casting, you can still mirror some content, including photos, videos, and music through Roku's app on the Play Store. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Roku and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.